Welcome back, guys, to Jared the Journeyman. My name is Kane Monroe, and today we're going to go over some definitions and terms that you're going to see in your journeyman's test that probably aren't in your code book. So if you guys are getting something out of this, there is a thanks button below. So if you don't mind, hit that. Drop a little coin down there just to show your support. And also it helps get equipment and stuff for this channel. Um, and if anything else, just give me a like and subscribe. So let's get going on this. On Let me share this screen with you. And here we go. And this is um, how to pass your electrical journeyman's test, some meanings and definitions that you're going to see. So we're going to go over these. I think I've got 10 questions in there, and we'll go over those. Like I said, there's not an article reference that I um, send you to. So let's get started. Number one, a voltmeter is used to measure what? And this, these are journeyman test questions, and that's electronic pressure. Next question, an ohmmeter reading infinite infinitely indicates what? And that's an open circuit. Guys, if you guys um get behind on this, you can stop the video or go back and rewatch this to get these correct answers. So the next one, electrical pressure or electromotive force is measured in what? And that's volts. Next one. Get out of the way. The ability of a material to permit the flow of electrons through it is called conductance. So you can it conducts the um, voltage through there. And then a standard impedance of a video coaxial cable is how many ohms, blank ohms. Um, this is not in your code book, and it's 75 ohms, and that's the standard impedance. Telecom wire grounded. On each end, what is the electrical path called? It's called a ground loop when they're when they're grounded on each end. Remember that one. What is the disadvantage of fiber optics over copper? And the answer is the cost of it. So this, there again, guys, not in the code book, but on tests. What is the measurement of the amount of signal for fiber optics? So what is that measured in? And that's bandwidth, bandwidth. Oh, this is a good one. What is the depth of a 40 foot pole, a wooden pole? What's the depth? What depth is a 40 foot wooden pole set? I'm sorry. So um, that is an alignments book. And what it is, it's six feet. So it's 10% of the pole, 10% of the pole plus two feet. So you got to remember that 10% of the pole would be four plus two would be six. What is RGV8 cable? All that is is coaxial cable, guys. Um, there again, not in the code book. Guys, thanks for watching. Like I said, if you got anything out of this, um, hit that thanks button and, and do me a solid and drop something in there. But also be on the lookout for more of these because I will be posting more of these um, the little videos with little how-tos and whatnots on how to pass your journeyman's test. So thanks for watching again, guys, and we'll catch you next time.